Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I know it's been quite some time since I made a video here. It's just been really important. I've just been really busy with work and, and my family and everything like that. But um, I definitely want to get back into the swing of things. I'm going to be changing the name of the channel from Edison only Yu-Gi-Oh to Retro only Yu-Gi-Oh because of the scene here in Jacksonville. Everybody, or not everybody, but we have uh, a lot of people that want to play uh, older formats here. So I feel like I, it'd be best to adjust the channel because I'm getting a lot of um, uh, in real life duels and in games at the shop that we go to to play and I feel like moving forward uh, it'd be best to just go that route with how the community is sort of evolving here in Jacksonville um, but I definitely want to get back on a consistent um, recording basis especially for getting videos out you know at least five a week so that's the plan um, but in the meantime here I'd like to go ahead and uh, play this flame bell zombie deck that I haven't played in a while I always really like zombies and I, I like the flame bell engine and I feel like they kind of pair nicely together and then after this video I have some some tango plant matches from locals this past week and then coming up this week, we have an Edison tournament, so a lot of things in the works. So let's see if we can go ahead and find a match here. Now, here at our, at our locals, Tang Tangu's kind of getting just as popular as Edison, so um, I didn't really expect that when I started the channel. I thought Edison would be the only uh, retro format that people would be interested in playing, but I think as more and more get popular, it'll, it'll evolve to where there'll be people wanting to play all kinds of different formats, which I think is cool. Oh my gosh, come on. There you go. Mm. Nice. This is like a really good hand. Solid. Set right going. Yeah. Set the right going pass. Sure. The fire dog, if he's not playing like a heavy back row deck. There you go. That's perfect. Hopefully that's not Raiko though. Mm. So we gotta decide if we wanna Raiko this or just get greedy and attack into it. They're all in picks. Oh. Yeah, that kinda changes things. Yeah, you probably gonna wanna do that. Oh gosh. That sucks. That sucks. That sucks. Uh, no, book of, we have book, that makes Book of Life live. Yeah. Spirit. Yeah, it's pretty straightforward here. Attack with that first recourse. Mm. I'm not going to attack with the Ryko. Okay, he's just gonna take it, but my intention was to not attack with the Raiko because I don't want to run into a gorge. He's playing some type of creature swap deck. Yeah, I don't really think those are real cards. Um, I'm not even afraid to really walk into a torrential right here either, yeah. honestly. So. I'm just going to actually let's just see what we'll start doing stuff. Yeah. So. Looks like he's a little Oh monsters. my gosh, come on. So. And it's like that was like obvious set too because it doesn't want to get spirit reapered, which makes sense. Yeah. Even if he turns us here, I'm not overly concerned. Ew. 
What is he playing? We're probably gonna win next turn. So that might be real. Okay. So I think you can just make a bryonic here. Yeah. Discard these two. Or no, discard. Discard. Yeah. Even if he stops the Brio, then you still could just rekindle it. Yeah. And you got flam about the fire dog. Right. He, he thumbs up. You good? Uh -huh. I need to type it though. I think I want to do this one here. I mean, it kind of makes it obvious that I have rekindling now. I think rekindling Book of Life is game. For sure. Plus the play. Let's see, it was at 23, 33, 43, 42, 52, 56. Uh, Book of Life. The Pyramid Turtle, once again. He does not have cores, so. I don't really know what he's playing, but going second, definitely, definitely mind control. yeah, mind control. So if I could take his hamster and get a Raiko. Some type of Raiko hamster deck. Going second, I think. I don't think he's using a side deck either, so. I don't know, a lot of monsters. Book of Moon might be a little bit weaker. Yeah, because he's just going to be setting stuff. Don't really know enough, but creature swap is kind of interesting. Shrink. Mm -hmm. But why do we only give him two turns there? We just opened really strong. This is okay. Could be better. Just need to draw like a Raiko or something, or a zombie. A goblin zombie would be good. Pyramid turtle would be good. I don't know. This is like our only. I don't really know if I want this to get like deprisoned. Could have said it. Like if it gets deep prison, it gets deep prison. Yeah. Well, it doesn't look like he opened very good, okay. so. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Just load up yeah. and just poke for 14. Doesn't look like he has monsters. So. If he sets some, if he sets something, I'm just gonna tribute for Caius. Yeah. Swing glads. Okay. Mm hmm. Yeah, he's probably got some shrink or book of moon. That's a war chariot. Yeah. So now that changes things a little bit. It's gotta be a war chariot. Uh, if you attack, he's probably just gonna shrink or book of moon. Something like that. As long as he doesn't have judgment. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna. So he's in a bad spot here. Um, you 
get the deep prisoner bottomless for any glad that he draws. Phase two, I feel like it might be better to Caius now. Yeah, I'll get your rekindling life. Let's me hit a war chariot or something. Take that. Uh -huh. Make sure everything's good. Mm. There's There's no need to set it. Anything that he does is getting stopped. It's probably a hawk. Or a hamster. It's a good card to draw. It's probably playing the test tape. Back but I don't have anything to deal with that. Fire metal would be nice. Yeah, if we could mill some flame bells off of this. There's no need to really set the mirror force there. But if that's a hamster, he's gonna flip it up and get what? What do you get in this thing? Test deep. Test deep. Okay. Or maybe a right go. Yes, that's good. That's good. Really good. I hope that's not a. Oh wow. Okay. You got deeper than that. Oh man, that would have been bad. Had I not bottom with that. What's he doing? He's attacking. Mm. Yeah, but I'm glad I'm bottomless that because yeah. if not, he didn't make guys errors. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man, defeat. Oh. Sick. Nice. Glats or trash. I don't know. He should draw any monsters. Too slow. Well, yeah. Plus, we had like the the right traps too, which I think helps. Um, but yeah, that was a quick one. But yeah, I think this deck's really good. Obviously, like Raiko's really strong. Being able to to get these guys in the grave with rekindling is really good. Zombies can help buy time and set up for powerful like synchro plays with Goblin Zombie and Magician. But yep, this is gonna be the first video. Uh, plenty more to come. The next one will be some tango matches. Uh, I want to try and get more in real life stuff now. Uh, I know Dueling Book can get, it's just not the same. So um, definitely want to get some, some Tango matches up. And then I've also been picking up decks for the March 2007 format, which is um, sort of the, the era where you had like Diamond Dew Turbo, um, Destiny Hero Monarchs, um, D Draws at three, Malicious is at three. Uh, been really having a lot of fun playing that. Um, we have a few guys at our locals that like to play it too. So I think getting some matches for that would be pretty fun for people that enjoy uh, playing in that time. And then, yeah, super excited. Well, I'm going to try and get the matches recorded for our Edison tournament this coming up week and get deck profiles. And yeah, I'm 100% back on the grind here. I'm going to get the name changed to, to retro now that um, the scene's growing and people are excited to play other formats, which I think is awesome. Uh, never would have thought we would sort of get as far as we've gotten here with it, but I'm excited to see it grow. And I appreciate everybody who, who watches and everyone who's kind of stuck with me here. Um, life's kind of gotten pretty busy, but I'm going to sort of uh, like really hunker down and, and you know make this a priority because I enjoy doing it. I, to me, it's, it's, it's a lot of fun. Um, it's real nostalgic to play these older formats. Um, just reminds me of better and simpler times. So I appreciate it. You guys have a great one. Thanks.